Watauga Arts Council with your host, Cherry Johnson, serving arts in Watauga County for more than 30 years. Hi, I'm Cherry Johnson with Watauga County Arts Council, and I want to introduce you to one of our wonderful artists. This is Jody Bargerstock. Jody's a whole lot of fun, and she recently did a uh, demo at one of our Second Saturday mm -hmm, events, mm -hmm. and you had that room packed the yeah. whole evening. <laughs> <laughs> I think most of the audience was back in Jody's room. <laughs> I didn't know that. <laughs> so you just kept people going the mm -hmm. whole evening. I know mm -hmm. you were doing things for children. Yeah. You were doing things yeah. just for fun. You were just yeah. showing off. You do something really fun called Alcohol Inc. that is really kind of new uh, mm -hmm. out there. How mm -hmm. long have you been doing Alcohol Inc.? Uh, since May. I took a course from Kathy Taylor in uh -huh. May, and I've been doing it almost daily. If I miss a day, I do two or three the next day. <laughs> it gets, I say I've become an alcoholic. <laughs> It gets in your blood. Alcohol and inkaholic. Yeah, alcohol <laughs> inker. Yeah. <laughs> There's a whole group of people growing throughout the country. Who well, and you're proliferating the group because you're mm -hmm. teaching a class yes, in I this am. I am. I can't <laughs> wait. I can't wait. So it's Jody's going to teach uh, our, our first visual arts workshop, actually, at the Blue Ridge Art Space. We're finally to the phase of doing the workshops. And Jody's going to be teaching a class starting November the 12th, 12th. at 1 o'clock. And it's a two and a half hour mm -hmm, session. Mm -hmm. And if I recall, you can sign up for six sessions mm -hmm. for $190. That's right, yeah. Or you can, if you're not you're going to be out of town yeah. or something like yeah. that, you can sign up one by one for yes. $35 uh, right. dollars a session. That's right. But you mm -hmm. need to sign up in advance because yes. the class is already starting to fill up, and mm -hmm. we're just now starting to talk about it. Mm -hmm. yeah. This tells Getting you something. Cool. <laughs> Joe, we can keep you really busy for a while. You could. <laughs> <laughs> I like being busy, and I like having fun, and this is fun. It's fun. Well, let's talk about Alcohol, Inc. Okay. It's, what what is this? I mean, you're using literally alcohol. Yes, is that this is 91% alcohol? alcohol, and uh, it's the best it's alcohol. It's the same thing you use and in it, medicine. It dilutes the yeah, inks. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's for medicine, yeah. And um, it helps spread the inks, and the inks that you buy are alcohol inks. And so they have alcohol in them, too? Yes, yes, okay. and lots of beautiful colors. If you like color, which I do, mm -hmm. uh, you will love these inks. And it dries quickly. Yeah. So that, um, and you can change, if you, as you'll see in the demonstration, you can change the color. Yeah. Uh, or, or dilute it or erase it just with alcohol. But because if you do something you don't like, mm -hmm. you go back and you put alcohol yeah. on it and it kind of goes it. away. Yeah. yeah. And then also, you're not, you, well, you do use a brush, but you use you about can. everything else too. You can use a brush, you can use a, a credit card, you can use, I like to use Q tips. Uh huh. Um, and I like to use cotton balls because if you put the alcohol in the cotton balls, that's another way you can get these little dots that you get uh, in here. Uh -huh. That'll pick the ink up. And I was doing stamping once with alcohol and some colors, and I right. just couldn't stop keeping my... I overstamped because it was so much fun Neat. stamping your design that you put on this little piece of um, felt. Uh -huh. And stamping it, you can put color on or you can take it out with the alcohol. It will take it out. It's just like anything goes. Yeah, anything goes. That's what I love. I love thinking outside the box, uh -huh. as most artists do. And anything goes. It's pure playtime. It's also not a highly controlled medium. You're right. You're right. <laughs> it controls you more than you control yes, it. When I first started doing this, I would paint at night and I would, oh, I would love the results. And the inks were still moving and whatnot. I go to bed and I come back in the morning and there'd be a blob. <laughs> <laughs> what happened to my creation? You got to take pictures as you go. <laughs> But How many kitty cats did you have playing in that during the night? None for that. They played everything else. But <laughs> and we were admiring some of Jody's creations uh, around us. And, you know, it's really fun because, it, like, this piece is just absolutely full of color. Mm -hmm. Totally full yep. of color. Yep. And yet, you've got something like this, which has a lot of pastels yes, in it. Yes, I know. I so know. is the pastel primarily just... It's a different ink. Mm -hmm. um, there are inks that are called, uh, they're light inks. Yeah. And uh, this was done by putting my inks on a paper towel. Right. And wiping it across, and it made oh, the sky. okay. And then there's certain inks, you, you do need to learn your inks. Right. And um, the more you play with it, of course, the more mm -hmm, you learn. And mm -hmm. being in my class, I can give you a heads up. And I do some exercises right. with my students so that they can learn, they can have a chart then of what inks do what. And get used to Yeah, them. yeah. and then they can mm -hmm, pick mm -hmm, that. Mm -hmm. But these were, except for the bright yellow in there, and this, this blue-green, they were pretty pastel colors. And 
Yeah. And, and the moon. Now, the moon looks like you did it after the background had dried. Yes, you have to uh -huh. do it after, or otherwise, uh -huh. it, in this just runs. sun, it runs. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, we well, started out with a round sun, up. and it kind of went. Yeah, I was holding <laughs> it up for the camera, and it kind of went wah, wah, wah. But sometimes <laughs> the sun does that. And then now, did I see you the other night blowing through a straw? Yeah, you can ink? blow through a straw. Some people who are big on this have compressors in their, oh in their studio, and they have a compressor, and they blow Very the Very controlled in. Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. uh, but, um, you know, or you can get a can of the stuff you use to clean your computer yeah. keyboard. Oh, yeah. Compressed air. Uh -huh. You can do that and blow it. And I have a couple of those going, because sometimes they jam, so you grab the next one. And you Neat. can blow. It's just, there's no end to this. There's and then no you end. said something about putting the alcohol in a spray bottle and spraying yes, it on there to get the, on there. the speckled yes, effect. Yes, you can get the speckled you know? effect. If you do it a whole lot, you'll get a drippy effect. Uh-huh. So it's just all play. <laughs> <laughs> you should never know what's going to happen. I was born for this. <laughs> And the colors, I love the intensity of these colors. Yeah, yeah. You know I like the, the colors that you do. You yeah, know. Yeah, so yeah. Jody has several pieces with us in our gift shop. And uh, some of them are very small, about that size. Mm -hmm. And they're yeah. just so bright and yeah, vibrant. Yeah, they, and, they light know. up a whole corner of a room. Uh-huh, they really do. <laughs> I mine around my house. They really do. Yeah. You're going to have to figure out a way to make this into jewelry, Jody. Oh, I have figured it out. <laughs> <laughs> I just haven't had time to do it yet. I definitely know how to make it into jewelry. <laughs> That's next. <laughs> <laughs> so n not just the money you make turning it into buying jewelry. You're talking about actually creating the jewelry. I'm creating yes, the jewelry. Absolutely. I cannot wait. Yes. Wow. Yes. Well, Blue Ridge Art Space is going to be a place for you to showcase anything yes. you okay. do like I that. Will. You know, I think that'll be fantastic. <laughs> yeah. You need to come and get involved with this and other wonderful, exciting art forms that we're just getting ready to unveil to you. Uh, there are so many fun and creative things mm. you can do in the arts world. You know, so much. You could be a child again. You could yes. be serious. You yes. can do whatever you'd like yes. in the arts, and it's just so much fun. Plus, the people you meet are amazing. Isn't that great? Oh, fabulous. I think that's Friends why I'm enjoying life. it so yeah. much. Yeah. <laughs> Friends for life. Yeah, really. Truly, truly. Mm -hmm. a, lot of, a lot of my dearest friends I've met through the arts and just had such a blast getting to know them. And, it seems like you're always learning more about each other as you're learning yes. more about the art, yes. you know, yes. so it's just so much fun. Yeah, it is. Jody, I can't wait for your class to start. Oh, I know. Well, you'll be, you can watch and <laughs> Absolutely. maybe you want to pick up some paper. I may, I may. Okay. Now, that, that does bring up something. The materials for this uh, I, I workshop. I sent you a materials mm -hmm. list. And so and we'll be sharing that with the registrants so yes, they can go yes, and get their materials? Yes, yes. Okay. and then you can buy them locally or you can buy them online. Okay, and, and you'll and give all that I'll information. Give you that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yes. So we're trying to make this just as simple and easy as possible and to make it a lifelong habit that you'll get into and you won't be like Jody, you'll be at every day if she's got to get up and do it again. Yeah, or I stay up and do it. It doesn't matter. <laughs> you can get up and do it, you can do it in the middle of the day. The nice thing is you can stop in your studio or wherever you paint, do a few things and walk out. It doesn't right. require a lot of time and I have some organizing skills that uh -huh. I can share. That's with the great. students and whatnot. So That's that, great. So they easy. can make it part of their everyday yes, life. Yeah. You know? in and, out. and also tips, I'm sure, on how to keep it from getting all over the entire world. Yes, yes. While you're yes. at it. Because I'm the famous one who spilled the yellow bottle of alcohol inks at Cheap Joe's. Oh. And it didn't want to come out of the floor. So mm. I, have, I, have, I have a rule, no big bottles. Because the little bottles, as you'll see in the demo, they have a squirter and they can fall over and not spill. Right. So no big bottles of ink Got in your you. studio. No, we in, definitely in, in aren't. Arts Council. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so please get involved. You're going to have so much fun doing this. And like I said, there's a lot of other wonderful art forms that we're just getting ready to unveil. Just all sorts of things. So if painting with alcohol inks isn't your thing, there's bound to be something that is. Mm, so uh, just stay tuned. Watch our website, watauga-arts.org, where we'll be posting all of this and a whole lot more. Watauga Arts Council with your host, Cherry Johnson, serving arts in Watauga County for more than 30 years.